Yeah, hey, what's up, you guys? Um, uh, yeah, since I've been gone, I haven't been able to do the updates and keep up with you guys. So, um, but yeah, as you see, it's kind of crappy looking. Um, because apparently, um, there wasn't, um, well, the person that was watching the tank did know how to, um, like, fill up the water, um, like, top off the water. It's supposed to be topped off to the, I have to top it off, like, eight cups a day because of the size, but there's a little squiggly line above that heater, and you're, and I fill it up there every day, so, um, yeah, <clears throat> but when I got home, you can see the water level, like, right here, and there's algae, and there's some bubble algae. All along here, you can kind of still see some, but I got some new snails, so that's kind of gone. That's why I can see the, like, trail marks and stuff. Um, but as you see, I got a whole bunch of these little snail guys, um, and they're helping me out a lot. Um, see all of them right there? I think I got, like, and maybe 15 um but other than that everything seems to be doing fine um so and I want to make my videos more interesting so um so what I'm gonna start doing is um I'm gonna start doing every Saturday I'm gonna do something called snail mail <clears throat> so what you guys are gonna do is you guys are gonna <clears throat> send me and this is optional you guys are going to send me a um, PM, a question, a comment, you know, anything you want, a PM, and have the subject be snail mail or something like that. So then I'll know to put it in the vid. So, but I did do a snail mail. Um, so and I just picked a random um, personal message from one of you, and this time... It's from um, this cool guy. Uh, oh, and first of all, I got this fast guard stuff to, and you put it in your filter bags on the filter, and uh, should lower the phosphates because my phosphates are like 0 0.4 right now. I want those to get down to zero. Um, now we look at the coral right there. Some are closed up a little bit. Um, but yeah. So this should help phosphate go down. These are just some supplements I put in. But now on to the room. Now I wasn't doing an update um, on the room, on my tank because it's, you know, gone. But here's the room now. I don't know, this room looks a lot different. The carpet's like all gushy and it's real nice we got this real nice computer desk here this is my two brothers computers that's mine that's my brother's um so we have the all these cool stuff hanging here um so yeah we have the lofts here and we have the tv up here this is my brother's bed and this is mine So it's a couch, bean bag, watch TV up here during the night, and this is my good friend, Duck. Yeah, he's just hanging there during the night. <clears throat> um, there's this. Put our stuff in, and I like to put my this one. Yeah, I put all my fish stuff here. Like, and I recommend you guys read these like reef magazines and stuff. They're pretty cool. I get these for free. Um, so yeah, our snail mail. Where did I put it? Uh, oh, right here. So I picked the snail mail um, from just a random person. OMG, cichlids. Um, so snail mail. Tiff, did would you from OMG cichlids? And he didn't send this. I just picked this randomly. So, um, so we got our snail guy here. Snail man. 
if you did, if you did, would you? I'm setting up a 300 gallon reef tank soon and it will have like a 300 gallon sump so it's going to be sweet and yeah oh and my friend is setting up like a 500 gallon reef t reef with like a 500 gallon sump and we're going to help him set it up this weekend it'll be beastly bro peace so um you guys want to send me some snail mail just um feel free to do so um, I can't wait till I get the fish tank from the Ella, from my local fish store in here this weekend. And I'll post a video on that along with some snail mail. Um, so, yeah. Um, can't wait to do that. Um, turn this into a sump. It's all going to be big and I'm going to do something called... Uh, I don't have a lot of time left, so but it's going to be called um, You Set It Up. And it's not going to be all of you, but I'm going to try to get you guys into it the most. Um, it's going to be, you guys are going to set up a sump. You're going to tell me what kind of, either to use glass or, what is it called? Or, I think it's called like, a, well, it's just other type of glass. Um, just what type of glass to use, you know, silicone. And you guys just tell me, like, what type of skimmer and stuff. Um, you guys just tell me out with all that. But remember, I'm on a budget, so, yeah won't be able to do everything you guys ask me but yeah hopefully these phosphates will drop I know it's really really bad right now so it's good that I'm gonna move these guys into the 45 gallon and um, to get these guys out of here and save and sound so um, hope you guys um, have a good time reefing send me some snail mail peace